I think, first of all, tonight, a very special thank you to Robert for putting on this amazing concert this evening. Um, that would have been nice if it had come from a few more. Here, here, it is amazing. Uh, just your expertise and uh, your love of music. I think you'll all agree that his love of music. <laughs> and also to Penny, thank you very much for coming and giving him time. And I'm really looking forward to hearing you sing the charity song. It, um, I think if you read the words of the chorus, they will touch your heart. They certainly touch mine, and um, I just hope I don't have tears tonight. But thank you so much. And I really can't forget, and they're probably hiding somewhere in the corner, uh, but the ladies who have organised the tea for afterwards. Um, you know, it's not just a matter of tea, but there's cakes and... I think I saw a bottle or two over there, so, um, you know, thank you to the ladies as well. And I know, Jen, you organised that, so thank you. I probably should have mentioned that Robert also has a great love for the work at Backer, and he has been an immense supporter Please afterwards have a look at the board and if there's anything else that you'd like to know, Nicola, who um, works with me, is also here and, um, and also Robert Foreman, who of course is one of our trustees. Um, he oh, sorry, sorry, I knew I'd get that wrong. Um, sorry, Robert Lee, wherever you are. Um, I know so you will be able to talk about uh, the work of the charity. So, and then of course a thank you to all of you for coming this evening and supporting the work of Aim for Change in Uganda. Um, the work that we're supporting tonight is Back to School and um, specifically the orphans. There are 500 children in this school and 300 are pupils, parents can pay a little. Um, 200 are orphans. Many of these don't have shoes and they don't have uniforms. And they are the ones that you'll be supporting tonight. Um, there is a picture on there of some of the orphans, so um, do have a look and you will understand where the money you have paid to come this evening is going to help. You know, it's very hard when you see the children and you see those in uniform and then you see those without uniform. And you know, it's almost half that school. If you think of 200 orphans and no uniforms, and many of them with no school, no shoes. Um, also, 27 have nowhere else to go and stay for the night, so they're boarding at the school. The biggest building, the top right, is the dormitory, and that holds 100 children. And we have 27 orphans in there. They have no mattresses, no sheets, no night clothes. At least that was until this week. And we were given a donation, and now we have been able to provide mattresses and sheets and night clothes. But for this evening, you will be giving uniforms to these children. You know, it's always broken my heart wherever I go to any of our projects and you see the orphans and you see how different they look from other children. So it's going to be such a thrill 
to be able to say to Pastor Bob, who oversees this work, that we can say, now they can have their uniform. I just wish I could be there to see the reaction of those children. Um, you know, there's a lot going on in other parts of the charity, but I was given five minutes tonight, and um, you all know when I talk, I speak much more than five minutes, um, but, and it's quite hard when uh, you have something exciting that is going on. Just before I do finish, I would like to mention about Pakistan and the floods. And the charity has now been able to help 72 families. Many have lost loved ones and children, um, but we've provided food and medicine. A lot of them are suffering with dengue fever. There are many diseases, but dengue fever is the worst one. So um, I know 72 is a drop in the ocean, but we've still been able to help 72 families. So and I know many of you have supported them, so thank you too for that. But I will finish now by just to say thank you to all of you for coming tonight and of course for the recital, because that's the most important thing. But uh, thank you for supporting us and the work of Aim for Change. Thank you.